friends of ours in Omaha called us and they were in the Omaha program and said, um, it's starting in Kansas City, you need to call right away because it's gonna fill up. And so we called and said, do you have any openings? Can, will you take us? And they said, of course. Make sure it doesn't fall off, everyone. No. Hopefully he'll learn um, just to have a love for music in general and um, to get to know you know other students who's his age that are into music. We're about to play our violins for the first time. I do remember a few times being very frustrated and thinking, oh, uh, am I ever going to get him to practice? Or are we ever going to get this? Wait, go, ready, go. And I, I feel like just now, I feel like everything's a little bit easier. We like to practice in the mornings before he goes to school. There's less arguments, and then he also gets to talk about it during the day at school. So that's really helped for us. His focus at times can be a lot better just from, I think, focusing on the violin. His dexterity is really good. I think part of that comes from playing with the violin. And when he's practicing rhythms or even dancing, I've noticed that he has a little bit more move in his step. <laughs> He just loves learning and learning new things, which is why I think the String Sprouts has been such a positive influence because there's new things every week and it's never boring. We're very thankful and grateful for the String Sprouts. Um, it's been such a wonderful opportunity to not only let our kids grow and learn and become better people, um, but it's helped us reach out and maybe meet some new people that we might not have met. I think everybody needs a little bit of strings in their lives.